Hello, I'm Sarah from South London Sling Library and today I'd like to talk to you about how to deal with the cooler weather um, as the winter approaches and you want to carry your baby in a sling or a carrier. So my first recommendation is to think about what your baby is wearing before they go into the sling. Um, if you're using a structured carrier such as this, this is the very lovely Tula Explore carrier. If you're wearing a structured carrier like this, then generally the carrier counts as a layer. If you're a very warm person, you may also count as a layer. So that's worth bearing in mind. If you're using something like a stretchy wrap or a close kaboo or the koala baby care band, that sort of um, carrier that has multiple layers, you need to count those layers. So those carriers ha generally have three layers to them. You have one piece goes over that way, another piece that goes over that way, and then a third piece that goes over um, horizontally across the top of the other two. So that counts as three layers. So you do need to consider it when you're dressing your baby. That's my first point. Think about what your baby's wearing before they go into the sling or the carrier. Um, you're aiming for indoor clothes. So in a single layer carrier like this, um, this baby is wearing, a, yes, you are wearing, a, so this baby's wearing a vest and a baby grow, and then they have the sling. I've got a, a vest top and a, gem, a normal top, a long, long sleeve top, so I'm wearing two layers, baby's wearing two layers, they've got the third layer of the sling, which the NHS guidelines say my baby should be wearing one more layer than me, then they're fine. If I was a very warm person, they'd probably be fine in here and just the baby go, they wouldn't need the vest. So that would be worth thinking about if I was a very warm person. If I'm then going out, it's much more convenient to layer over the top of your sling or your carrier, because if the weather changes, and you know what it's like in the UK, um, we can have three seasons in one day, um, but if the weather changes while you're out, if you've layered over the top of your sling, it's really easy to then add and remove the extra layers as you need to. Whereas if you've got your baby in a snowsuit or a coat or a cardigan or something, and you need to remove layers, you've got to take the sling off to be able to remove those layers. So trying to layer over the top of the sling is generally much easier than to adjust the layers kind of through the course of the day as you need to. Um, so first things first, uh, obviously, if you're going out and it is cold, then you might need to think about whether or not your baby needs a hat. I don't have any baby sized hats, so we're going to pretend that my baby's wearing a hat. Um, you might then want to consider, obviously, legs sticking out of the sling. So baby leg warmers are a really easy way just to add an extra layer to the baby's leg because it's sticking out of the sling. These are by the very wonderful Moomo baby. Um, they're lovely soft jersey and on the inside these are fleece lined so they're proper snuggly they're really really nice and you can simply bunch that up pop it over the baby's foot and pull it up and I can tuck that in kind of under the edge of the sling there um, and then my baby's got those extra layers on their feet and then should we go into a, get onto a bus or a train or go into a shop or into a coffee shop or a cafe, or I can always very easily just remove those layers and baby's back to indoor clothing. Um, so that's one way. The other thing is while you've got a small baby, it's very easy to have a nice oversized fleece or jacket or cardigan that will quite easily do up over both of you. So baby's nice baby's basically got my body heat i'm nice and warm i've got my jacket on um but it does up around both of us baby's nice and warm as well i want to be can be careful not to obstruct their airway but again this is about what you can see not what people approaching you can see so from your point of view um you can't see my baby's face but when i look down i can very clearly see my baby's face i can see they've got plenty of air circulating and if we're out and about and there's a bit of a a breeze, they, they, my baby is absolutely in no danger whatsoever. I'm still ticking all my safety boxes, the, the ticks uh, safety guidelines. Um, so I know that my baby is perfectly comfortable in the sling with my coat done up over both of us. As your baby gets bigger, you might start to find that you can't get your coat done up around both of you. 
Um, there are lots of ways to deal with this as an issue and I'm going to show you a couple of ways from a really lovely company called Annie's Accessories and I will link to both these products in the description below this video. Um, if you want to hire either of these products from the Sling Library, you absolutely can. Um, and the beautiful thing about that is if you hire either of the products I'm about to show you from the Sling Library, um, you can then get a 10% discount from Annie's Accessories on either of these things. So let me show you these. This is the cozy clip-on coat extender from Annie's Accessories, jacket extender. Um, and it just has little clips here. So it's universal. It will clip onto any coat or jacket. Um, and the great thing about this is it will bridge the gap between the two sides of my coat. I've got the bottom part of my coat done up. So I've got my baby's feet inside there, keeping their feet nice and warm. Um, but then if I get onto a bus or a train, go into a shop or a cafe or get home, my baby's asleep. I don't want to have to wake them up to take their coat off. I can simply undo the clips and I'm back. I'm in indoor clothes, baby's in indoor clothes. We're not going to overheat anybody. Um, it's made of beautiful soft shell material. So it's waterproof, windproof. It's fleece lined. Um, so it's nice and snug and warm. Um, and you've got a little hood for when your baby gets bigger. Um, they can have their own protection from the rain. If you've got a jacket where you've got a hood or you can carry an umbrella because your hands free, um, then it's absolutely perfect. So they're really, really good. Um, like I say, universal will fit onto any uh, coat. It then makes it really easy to share between you. Um, so obviously you can get baby wearing coats and I've, I've got another video that I shot a few years ago before things like this were available um, that I'll also link to in the video description. And in that video, you can see a baby, one of the baby wearing coats. Um, I've got the Wallaby coat from Wombat and, and Co. Um, but the thing about that is, is you would possibly need two coats if you're both carrying the baby and you're gonna wear a baby wearing coat. Something like the jacket extender, you basically leave it with the sling and then whoever's got the baby in the sling has the jacket extender because it will fit in anybody's jacket, it's universal. So it's fantastic. So that's one option. Here's another. This is the Hug Me universal sling cover carrier cover now you don't have to go for full-on rainbow i love this one and the inside is amazing um you don't have to go full-on bright and leery um but they have got some amazing uh, uh fabric uh, and his accessories honestly you've got to go and look because there's something for everybody but they can also do nice muted ones if that's your preference as well. So don't be scared away by the rainbow. I just love the rainbow. Um, this pops on around your shoulder strap. So this will work with any carrier that has two, any sling or carrier that has two shoulder straps because it has poppers. So all you do is loop it around your shoulder strap and pop it together. So in that way, it will fit any carrier or sling. Um, you can then use the elastic and just tuck your baby's foot in. It's got toggles so you can tighten that elastic for a smaller baby. Little hood. This hood is reversible so this will also work with the baby in the facing away position. Um, and this one has a two-in-one pocket so it's got space for me to put my hands in there to keep my hands warm but it's also got, here it is, a little zip so that I could put my phone or my debit card or my keys, whatever I needed to, in that little uh, pocket there as well. So again, made of soft shell fabric with fleece lining. Um, it's, it's just phenomenal. The workmanship involved in this is just, honestly, it's amazing. It's the sort of thing that has to be seen to be believed. Um, so if you'd like to borrow it from the Sling Library, you're more than welcome to. Um, and then you can get a 10% discount from Annie's accessories as well um, for those who have hired it. Um, so yeah, this is another option. If your coat doesn't do up around your baby, this can be great. It goes on to the sling. So if you were carrying your baby on your back, you can still use it. Um, it will fit up to around about three years old, I think. 
um, it's just phenomenal. Um, so if yeah, you don't want the investment of a baby wearing coat or perhaps you both equally carry your baby and so you don't want to have to buy two baby wearing coats, um, then this sort of thing is most definitely an option. Um, if I had a nice kind of fitted scarf for myself, that would keep this part of me warm. Um, and then my baby's nice and cosy in my uh, sling cover. Uh, and then again, you go onto a bus or a train or you get home and baby's asleep, you can just undo. And if I was on a bus or a train or just in a shop, I would just do that and leave it hanging to the side. Then I can just do it back up again when we go out. If I would got home, undo both sides. And again, if I took my jacket off, I'm in indoor clothes, baby's in indoor clothes. Um, so really simple and easy ways to um, protect yourself from the elements for you and baby from the elements when you're out and about so I hope that helps again if you'd like to see either of those things uh, they are available on the sling library website southlondonslings.co.uk and both available to hire um, and yeah if you'd like to see them in person catch up with me at one of the sling support sessions or at a, a consultation um, I hope that helps uh, again, I'll link to my older video shows other options for carrying in changeable weather as well. Um, but you can find links to all these things in the description below. Thanks a lot. Stay warm and I'll see you soon. Bye.